that. Obviously, obviously. Already 13th, she's already out of Somersault Pike for the German diver. So I was set, expecting a better, better dive from the G4, extending her legs and getting a pike. The dive is very low, very, very. Uh, 49.50 for her. Um, she is uh, sixes. Instead, is fours. So that means like full twist for the German diver. Hurdle off rhythm. Um, the jump though was good. She came out of the pike position very early, slowing down the dive, and that's that's the reason why she ends up being uh, quite shy. and not vertical. Five and a half, six for her. Fifty and a half goes too far over on her front three and a half somersault pike. We're focusing here. And a good job. Very good front three and a half somersault pike. Probably not the highest we have seen and that we will see throughout the competition, but Ashti, we saw it from this long. Uh, this is why I say, uh, I talk about the hands in the, the entry. I'll explain place. Uh, with sixes, that would have been 54. So above average, she, instead of that, she gets 39 points, 194. Bad hurdle by uh, eleven and a half to get on the board, but she does an amazing job in the air, squeezing the pike position and a perfect lineup for great entry sevens from the judge at the moment. And she does a great job, a good dive to start off the competition. Saskia Ottinghaus now inward to of the final, even with a lot of divers still to go. Saskia. Ottinghaus back to now Somerset Pike and Saskia was in seventh in the top 12 divers, but she is capable also. It's seen a lot of bad hurdles, and uh, but no problem at all making the final for Saskia. We'll see more of. And the judges were uh, didn't like this dive as much as I liked it, probably.